What is this thing? Is it dead? Unconscious. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Let's split stack. Split in half. I don't know. Maybe it'll come back up for air. It will probably die. <laughs> don't get me wrong. I have no... Whoa! Shark! Hello, everyone. My name is Dredden, and we are in Ark. Okay, so... I have done a fair bit of leveling up since the last time we played. Um, and right now, I think it's time we try to hunt down that one. If it's not too high up level, that is. Okay, so I've been playing some multiplayer with Hal. And uh, I've been just learning a lot. Um, level 14, that's a bit high probably. Um, how many arrows do I have? 31, 32, okay. Um, let's see here. I mean, maybe with a few good shots, we might be able to make this work. But basically, I haven't been able to do anything for the hide until I got, you know, a bow and arrow here. All of a sudden now, things are starting to get unlocked. Uh, but, as I kind of thought, things aren't going to work out too well for me. Oh, and especially if I hit the wrong critter. Might run back this way. Um, you know what? Screw that guy. Let's try this one. 15? Nah. Too high. Level 2! Oh, who knows what we're going to hit there. Don't hit the Brontos, I assume, because that would probably be bad. So, really? Where to go now? Okay, no idea. I still don't find hunting easy. But, you know, it's not nearly as bad as it was before, so that's something. Um, could have swore I saw that jerk run down here, that uh, really colorful one. But, maybe not. Now, most of the hunting I've done is uh, more up above me here, if I can just figure out where the heck that is. Yeah, I think I'm a little bit... No, oh, maybe not. That's where it is. I've died a couple times. Um, not so much anymore of um, starvation or anything, which is fantastic. And I've been testing them some things out. You know, down here I was testing to see if these guys could break through these walls. And yeah, they can, of course, because these are thatch walls. I didn't know before, but I know now. Um, but it worked for, you know, temporarily slowing them down. Um... <laughs> Welcome to my giant staircase that I thought would maybe work, make me go, you know, have a nice path down there. It really took, it's taken a lot of work, and um, I'll probably still work on it some more. There's me, another me, and um, the problem is, yeah, I was up there and I've been trying to build this tower thing. There's another me. <laughs> I've taken apart and reassembled a lot of this thing. Um, you know, it's got a good view. We go up here. But this is where I got a lot of experience from because um, building is good. Now, I've actually increased just recently my XP gain by up to two and my collecting up maybe by three or something. I just, I can't um, be making videos and taking forever to grind stuff out, you know? It's just, just not, doesn't work. I spent um, a lot of hours in this game relative to any other game that I play for one episode. Um, it, it's been quite a while, but I've learned a bunch of stuff. Um, up here, I haven't really done much. There's this guy here. I don't really know what's up with it. It's just red. I guess, yeah, there's a couple of reasons for it. It could be red. Now, these are probably my best source of food so far. Um, you know, just coming in here and mowing down on all these plants. It's been pretty good. And then, uh, yeah, see, for example, that parasaur. I bet you I can take him out. Because it is kind of in the area that should be in... Okay, where are you going to go?
I put a little bit of a barrier down over there, too. Ah, oh, these trees, man, they're just like... these bushes are just... They are not good. So it is quite possible it ran down, but you can see my barrier up over there. We just have to catch up to it. Because it is too far ahead. Oh, is this like one of those walking guys up there? So I don't know if this... I don't think that it'll really work. Yeah, it's just running around. Oh, there we go. So, anyway, I think I'm too far away. You have killed maybe two or three things so far. The other direction here is not so good. And now is not fantastic. Oh, no. Um, yeah. So... <laughs> Put that away, run towards it. Yeah, but I've kind of cut out a lot of stuff for you guys that um, was me learning. Some of these mechanics and such. And then um, because I've been doing a multiplayer game with Hal, I have also picked up a lot of stuff from him too. Don't go out there. There are sharks out there. Come on, die already! I mean, maybe more headshots would be good, but... There we go. You see? Finally, able to survive on my own, can collect hide. Hopefully no megalodons come and get me. Get my arrows, maybe? No. But whew, man, that has been, uh, it was a struggle there for a long time to try to get this all figured out. At any rate, I think, um, what I'm going to do is set up, I mean, I don't know, I'll probably build a bit more on this. I don't really have a good base. I don't really need one here, though. It's pretty calm and peaceful other than, you know, not being able to get much food. But now that I've got some arrows and I can kill things, I will be able to do things with hide. And I do want to make a base probably up here. What I kind of wanted to do was build that tower tall enough so that I could make some of these... Um, where do they go? The walkways? They're somewhere in my thing, I think. Wow. There it is. Catwalks. So I may or may not do that. I don't really know. Um, eat some of that food. Because, yeah, like I said, I killed a couple of animals already, so that's awesome. But I don't want to put too much up here in terms of foundations because I don't want to wreck these berries and stuff that are coming in here. They are incredibly useful to me. Uh, and I don't want to destroy those deposits up there either because they are also very good things. So, with that said, I mean, you know... If I could just have a nice easy way down here, that'll be good. And then um, I plan on building like a boat for this river. I assume that's awesome. <laughs> I don't know. I've never built a boat. I just know that you can. And they look fun. If you know anything about boats and uh, all that kind of stuff, let me know. Because, you know, that'd be great to learn. Um, I also thought I built... or I have the engram for it. I do have it. There it is right there. A club. So... I don't know if I can actually do one right now. Um, I think what I would need to do is way, way over here. I'd have to expand on my little, I guess, trap thing first. That looks like a meat-eating dinosaur. Awesome. Cool. We're not going to bug him today, but I've been over there a number of times and never seen that dude before. So yeah, what I plan on maybe doing is expanding the size of that and making like a taming pen, I guess is what people kind of call them. So yeah, we will do that at some point. Um, and over here, yes, that should get slowly... Well, I don't know if I can actually make it any taller now, just the way that I built it. The building this game is incredibly awkward. Now, I never really realized how... 
tricky. <laughs> it was. Yeah, that was a great time for that to come out. Um, I'm really used to Seven Days to Die. And they have a pretty good building system. Um, you know, we can discuss that a little bit if you want to talk about it, not just complain about it. <laughs> so, I mean, I know there are flaws in it too. But I think it's way better than this. Um, because yeah, I can't seem to really build more up there unless I go crazy. I think what I possibly will do is just build a totally square tower and have it go up. I was really just hoping to have a shortcut with like a ladder going up there and then going into a hatch or something, but it's I don't know, man, it's tricky. It doesn't quite um, work like I would like. So, yeah, what I'll probably end up doing is turning this into a squarish tower um, which will take a lot more resources and then it'll head over there uh, and in the meantime though if I can catch one of those even one of those little pig creatures I thought I was gonna try to skip past that but you know what I don't have that kind of skill and then I can make it carry this one down there carry a bunch of stuff around with me here um, maybe let's go grab some of those berries I've got s somewhere I don't know got some in here I think yeah, let's grab a bunch of these guys, throw them there. And I guess I'll also throw this meat in here to cook. Mm, actually, I think I need this for something else. So, but we'll just put some more of that in there, and I'll keep working on it. Yeah, because there's like a narco berry recipe or something that has to deal with that, from what I understand. These are my extra clothing, just in case I die in whilst I'm making this episode. <laughs> I'm, I'm a little more prepared than last time, eh? We'll have to go get some more of those... Uh... Oh, this is already full, isn't it? More of the arrows made. Um, I mean, they're my lifeblood at the moment. Um, I guess a bolo would probably be a good idea to get, too. But I just started to get the leather, so... Between there, here and there, I will be building a lot more of those. So... Having trouble? Hmm? Maybe a little bit? Mm hmm I figured as much. So yeah, I don't know if that dude is down here. Um, even if I could get him to follow me around, and then I'll make a... little... saddle for him. I probably won't ride it, actually, if I can tame one of those little dudes. Um, what about you? Level 5. I don't know, maybe. Maybe. Let's try. I tried this in one of Hal's. Or in the, the multiplayer game with Hal there. And it didn't really work out for me very well. And this one I'm slower. Because I haven't um, gotten that one up. Yeah, you can go out there, whatever. I'll try this guy next. Eee, not the Triceratops. Go to sleep. <laughs> I don't know, man. It's a tricky game. This is, I guess, why, yeah, taming pens. Did you poop on me? Taming pens apparently were, work pretty well. Just gonna eat a steak out here while you... Vanish? There you are. You go back out there. Um, I'm faster than you on land and water. Oh! There's a shark. Going back in. I'm not messing with that shark. Hi! How's it going? <laughs> so many dinosaurs that I just can't tame at this point. Um, well, I guess those sharks are gonna get you guys. I don't dare go out there. I've seen what those sharks can do. But yeah, so I imagine um, next episode I should have a bunch of bolos. Yeah, see? There's a Megalodon. Told you you shouldn't be out there. You're watching the show too, eh? I know. 
It's good stuff. If I go out there, though, you'll probably get taken. Can you get on that little piece of land there? Hmm. Uh, I guess so. Maybe I should try out there. Where's the shark? Down there. This is a bad idea, I think. Up, up, up. Up! Give me some water. Some air out of the water. Please. Oh, God. Up! Up! Oh, God. It's right behind me. I know it. Hi. You can go to sleep now. No? You going back out there? That's where the shark is! Oh, it's after that. It's Stegosaurus. And... I'll probably get eaten from behind. Just a giant coelacanth. Good. Okay, back up here. Come on, little guy. There you are. I just want to be friends. And have you as my friend forever. Go to sleep. Okay. Come on up. Just can't knock these things out. At all. Hey! Uh-oh. Need some food. Uh, let's eat those guys. Okay, can I get this body or... What is this thing? Is it dead? Unconscious. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Let's... Split stack. Split in half. I don't know. Maybe it'll come back up for air. It will probably die. <laughs> don't get me wrong, I have no... Whoa! Shark! So, yeah. I think taming takes a long time. Especially if you don't turn the rate up. Um... So, yeah. Oh, there he is. Ah! <laughs> Yikes. Well, there goes my tame. <laughs> oh, that did not sound good. So, what you doing there, big fish? Can I tame you? Oh, God. He definitely ate the other one. He definitely ate it. Oh, man. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, there goes my first tame. Yeah, right. Okay, anyhow. So, um... Yeah, that's basically it. I mean... I will attempt to set up some sort of better conditions for that. Hopefully I can figure it out. Um, obviously this club needs to be repaired. Oh, that's a brontosaurus. If you uh, want to see my shenanigans with brontosauruses, you should definitely check out my multiplayer with Hal. <laughs> it was... They, uh, they like to not forget. They're like elephants. They just don't stop. Oh yeah, I also found out that, yeah, if you go into third person, I mean, somebody mentioned this. Uh, well, I figured out generally a lot better ways to, like, harvest these plants, but, I mean, there's no point if you don't have a foundation here. They just keep, you know, spawning back. It doesn't really matter, so it's not really that useful. But yeah, I was thinking about making some sort of, like, um, well, where I grew up, there was, like, this buffalo jump, and I think it would be kind of cool to build, I don't know, some sort of, like, pen, drop, some drop pen in here or something, right, where you can just, like, Chase them off the edge. There isn't really generally too many up here though, but probably getting really friggin' hungry. But if I could chase them off 
this edge, it would be pretty good. They could just fall into a little pen, and I could, you know, make them food or make them into a team. I think that'd be pretty good, good times there. Anyhow, so I'm gonna, you know, take whatever advice you guys give me on that kind of stuff and try to put it to use. So that I can hopefully do more good stuff. Alright guys, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. If you are new to the channel and like what you see, hit the subscribe button. I will be playing more of Arc Valergo, um, both by myself and with Hal, as you know, time progresses. Um, our other game is m way more accelerated because we boosted the levels of stuff up. I kind of wanted to get a feel for the vanilla game, and um, yeah, there's a couple things that I thought could be rebalanced already. Um, like I said, experience and stuff. I, I just I don't have time to spend forever grinding. I, I don't mind it a little bit, but a little, it's got to be tweaked. Anyhow, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.